the first time we assume is where we get caught up in a bad spot. So whether it's a hangnail or it's a threat of a weapon, uh, we're going to take those seriously. A high school student now charged after police say they made a violent threat toward West Aurora High School. A picture of that threat shared on social media well before police knew about it. Elizabeth Matthews has the story from Aurora. The picture of graffiti was first shared on Snapchat, then on Facebook. And while police were able to apprehend that juvenile suspect here on the high school campus, there were hours wasted of social media chatter instead of police work. As soon as it hits that social media sphere, um, it catches fire and people grab it. District 129 Superintendent Jeff Craig says that's what happened with this picture of a written threat against West Aurora High School. It reads, quote, get ready, West. On 10-12-2022, I'm killing. For hours yesterday, this circulated social media before school leaders or police were notified. Taking a picture of it and reporting it to law enforcement helps us greatly. Sharing it on social media before contacting law enforcement just slows down the investigation. They searched the school last night and found the origin of the post, a written message scribbled on a bathroom wall inside the high school. This is uh, a process of interviewing witnesses, reviewing uh, footage that could uh, indicate and identify um, possible suspects. Aurora Police Investigator David Guevara says they increased their presence during school hours as a precaution, while many kids just stayed home. Notice there's a bunch of kids missing from classes. Guess they didn't want to come to school. It's just hard to know what's like what's a threat and what's not, and um, this shouldn't seem like a big deal. Superintendent Craig reminds students, staff, and parents that they take every threat seriously, adding he wants kids to build trust instead of staying on social media. I think it's super important that uh, a kid finds that one trusted adult. I don't care if it's a custodian, I don't care if it's their bus driver, if it's their lunch server. Get that information to an adult so they can get it to the right spot so we can act on it. The juvenile suspect is now facing one count of disorderly conduct. In Aurora, Elizabeth Matthews, Fox 32, Chicago.